talking to Jack, the Athenian McLean. Always good to speak to you, Jack. Um, a fight with uh, George Hilliard at mm -hmm. the O2 Arena, and already you've succeeded on social media upsetting him. What? What's yes, that about? so um, <laughs> as I like to do, I like to get into my opponent's heads is a that little what, bit. Is that the plan, get into? Always, because I do notice he is one of those serious type characters. Um, from what I've seen of him anyway, yeah. but I've met him today and not so much, you know, definitely not, he's not no Ellis Shepherd, you know, really yeah. angry, yeah. nothing like this. That's what I was thinking maybe he's like, I don't know. But um, yeah, so I did a little call out to him and um, seemed to get him going a bit. He's a bit, a bit, a bit. A bit, you know, he's a bit sort of a bit tense, you know, what, who is this guy, you know, what, why is he so confident? What has he got that I haven't? You know, I like to know everything about my opponents. What, what do they like to wear? What's their favourite colour? What do I eat for breakfast in the morning? What makes them tick? Well, so you'll know then, he's got a great glove boxing record. Yes, very good glove boxing record. About 20, he's had 27 wins. Well, that's with British board yeah. as well, so not no unlicensed And, and with boxing. the Irish, he's won. Yeah. He's, he's been WBU champion here in yeah. America. I yeah. mean, you're talking about a, a, a class act. A serious, but serious. this is BKB. This is a totally different sport. And when he's going to feel these ancient Greek knuckles come crashing down into his nose and lips and eyes and ribs, he's going to know about it. He's going to know about ancient Greece. Which is why you're the Athenian. That is why. I've travelled through time to get here. I, w I was captured by the Romans and forced to fight in the Colosseum. They took my wife, enslaved her. The Dominus was banging her in the next room while I was there, sweeping his lawn of the leaves in autumn. But now I'm here and I will not be captured. I will get my freedom. I don't really know what to say after that, if I'm honest. But what I will say is, um, when that bell goes, you've got to be at it. I will, absolutely. I predict it's going to be a bloodbath because, you know, I've come for a lot to, to get here, yeah. you know. Yeah. I've had my problems. Even recently, I had, after I'd taken a victory of Patrick Nash, I did spiral a bit out of control, you know. I had some few issues messing around, and uh, that brought me down. Are you in control now? I'm absolutely. By the power of Christ, yeah. our Lord Jesus, yeah. you know, he's saved, saved me. What I've been through, I know my faith is so strong now. I'm actually a mystic that I speak to God personally. And um, not like he talks. Like, no, I, I, get, yeah, I know you exactly where you're but coming from. I Spiritually. feel the power yeah. of God within me. And I really, truly believe Lee, that, um, you know, I'm going to get this victory on the 26th of March. Well, if you're going to have somebody in your corner, there's nobody better to have than God, to be exactly, fair, I suppose. Exactly, exactly. Um, but, as I said, and, and I know what you bring, mm. you're a warrior, mm. you bring it all to the ring, I, I've seen that, mm. but you, you, you're coming up a guy who, not necessarily a tear-up merchant, but he gets in, he gets out, mm. you're going to have to work hard to hit him. Yeah, yeah. So I'm going to be working, I've got uh, some new coaches. All right, OK. So I'm working on my accuracy. And I like to hit from range. Um, I like to fight it, because that's what I learned yeah. when I fought Shepard, right? He's right. similar, yeah. okay? And when normally I fight Mex, I like to be no gloves, so I fight Mexican, you know, coming in close, but that's no good in knuckle fight. You no. don't want to be hit at all, yeah. because one hit, can you be knocked out? Mm -hmm. You know, or destroy the eye. I remember I fought Shepard, and okay, yeah, I did the mongoose technique. I told you about yeah, that. Yeah, you did. So what actually happened, right, is um, basically I, I knew he was angry, and I wanted uh, my first one. I wanted to be a very big, uh, dramatic victory. So what I actually did is I got my corner to have a tomato ketchup Heinz. So as I went to the corner, right, I quickly got him to rub it, and uh, and in my mouth, right, and then when when he hit me that first time. I quickly had some in my hand, like a, a sachet, which I got from the chippy. I quickly rubbed it in there, and then as I went down, I just dribbled it out. So you see all that, what it looks like I'm bleeding. So he thinks you're gone. Yeah, so he thinks he's getting more and more mad, thinking, yes, working him up. 
and I was totally fine, right? And then I, even the Vaseline, I, I put some cotton wool buds just under my eye there. Like, you know, like, yeah. I put them in to make it look like swelling. Yeah, and then, and then it makes him more and more aggressive. And then the last time I was going to go that third time down, yeah, so I'd had all cotton wool all stuffed up, tomato sauce all in my face. That's called the mongoose technique, yeah? Look at, what's his name? Um, I forget his name now, but mongoose, yeah, the old mongoose, he does that. He goes down, you think he's hurt. Faints. Faints. Yeah, You feign the knockdown, so then they come running, and then it was going to be a dramatic, but unfortunately they stopped it too soon. So technically, I'm... Um, Undefeated. Even when I fought Sernar, yeah, they're calling the poison arrow. Yeah. Do you know why? Because he's Mexican, right? The poison dart. He had a poison dart in his hand. So he hit me, yeah, and suddenly my body started really, I couldn't breathe. I got pain in all my body, you know, and that was obviously the poison arrow. So he's cheated. So I'm still undefeated. I'm four and oh. Wow. Well A BKB or was it three you and oh? Yeah, four yeah, and oh. You yeah. always bring you always bring everything to the ring. You leave nothing in the ring. Um, that's why people love watching your fights. Yeah. Um, may the best man win on the night. Absolutely. Jack, good luck. This was and thank you. Remember follow Spoxio, my my app, the sports in app. What you will get um, you sign on to it. Sport Spoxio is a sports app like Instagram, up and coming, big time. Stay alpha.